Hello and welcome back to the channel. If you're anything like me, you have a list of places you dream about visiting, but have you ever wondered how to keep track of all those amazing destinations and experiences? Today, I'm going to show you how to build an epic travel bucket list using one of our favorite tools, Google Maps. Trust me, this is a game changer. So let's dive in. Welcome to World Wanderers. We're Alicia and Will. Come wander the world with us. First things first, you'll need to have a Google account to use Google Maps effectively. If you don't have one yet, no worries. It's a free service, so just create one and you're good to go. Once you're logged in, head over to Google Maps, either on your computer, tablet, or mobile app. I prefer to do the heavy lifting on my computer and then reference or add places while I'm on the go using my phone. Now, let's start building your bucket list. This is where the magic happens. On the left-hand side of your Google Maps screen, you'll see an option called Saved. Click on it. A menu will pop up with tabs for Lists, Labeled, Visited, and Maps. Select Lists. Here, you'll find an option to create a new list. Click on New List, give it a catchy name like My Travel Bucket List, and hit Create. Now you've got the foundation set. Let's start adding some dream destinations. To add a location, use the search bar at the top to find a place you want to visit. Let's say you've always dreamed of visiting Barcelona, Spain. Type it in, and once the location pops up, you'll see a Save button. Click it and choose My Travel Bucket List from your list options. And just like that, Barcelona is added to your bucket list. It's that easy. You can do this for every city, landmark, or restaurant you dream of visiting. Let's add a landmark. So let's say I want to visit the Sydney Opera House. I'll search for it, and then it should pop up and show some information about it. Repeat these steps for each of your must-see places. You can even add places like cafes, parks, or famous streets, basically anything that sparks your interest. I particularly like to add locations of good photo ops, for example, the perfect street corner to stand on and take a photo in front of the Eiffel Tower. You can also use the street view by clicking that little man to make sure that you're placing the pin or location in the exact location you want to save. This is especially helpful for places that aren't like a business or a specific address. Or I'll add locations of awesome restaurants that people have recommended to me personally. Once you've added some locations, you can view your list by clicking on the Saved tab again. Here, you'll see all your saved places under My Travel Bucket List. To make your list more visually appealing and organized, click on a place and you can add notes. I might put something like must visit in spring or great for sunset views or closed on Sundays. Here, I'm adding that note about why I picked a random street corner in Paris so that I remember I need to go there for my perfect pick. I'll hit done and my note will automatically be saved. I regularly use my list when planning trips and realize I have more time in a location or an extra day to play with and I don't know what to do with that time. I may zoom out on my map and see what nearby cities or attractions I can add into my trip as well. Especially in Europe, I sometimes don't realize how accessible a second item on my bucket list is until I'm viewing the map and realize, wow, this country is actually right next door to this other one that I am dying to see something in. Oftentimes, this other country is just an hour or two train ride away, and this map allows me to visualize the possibilities. One of the best things about using Google Maps for your bucket list is that it's always at your fingertips. When you're traveling, just open Google Maps app on your phone, go to Saved, and you'll see your bucket list right there. You can use it to navigate directly to the spots you've saved or get inspired when you're nearby. No more scrambling to find the list you wrote in a special notebook that you left at home or scrolling through hundreds of bookmarked pages. Everything is right here, neatly organized and ready to go. Planning a trip with friends or family, Google Maps makes it super easy to share your bucket list. Just open your list, click on the three dots next to the list title, and select Share List. You can share it via email, messaging apps, or social media. 
This way, everyone can add their own ideas and keep track of the plan together. This works great for a group trip, or in my case, I share the list with my husband and we both add our bucket list items because realistically, we almost always travel together and if he's going somewhere bucket list worthy, I'm coming along. So there you have it, a simple yet powerful way to build and organize your travel bucket list using Google Maps. Whether it's a weekend getaway or around the world trip, having your dream destinations just a click away makes planning so much easier and more fun. Thanks so much for watching. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more travel tips and inspiration and to wander the world with us. And if you have any favorite apps or tips for planning trips, let us know in the comments below. We love hearing from you. Also, check out our latest video on other essential travel apps that can make your adventures even better, which you can check out here. Safe travels.